whether it's too hot to turn on the oven or you've got to figure out snacks for soccer practice in 30 minutes, these delicious peanut butter cereal bars provide a good source of protein and can be cheaper per serving than buying pre-made granola bars. If you can't use peanut butter, this recipe works great with sunflower butter or other nut butter. It also works with any dried fruit you have on hand. To make this recipe, you'll need measuring cups, a medium saucepan, an eight by eight or similar size pan, a knife or sturdy spatula, parchment paper, and a stove. My ingredients are laid out over here. I have a half cup of honey, just a note, honey, it's not recommended for children under one years old. One cup of peanut butter, two cups of crispy rice cereal, two cups of old fashioned oats, and one cup of raisins. I also have non-stick cooking spray to keep the bars from sticking to my pan. In my soft pan, I'm gonna bring the honey to a boil. You wanna make sure you're using a saucepan that's large enough to accommodate all the ingredients to make this a one bowl recipe. Once that's boiling, I'll add my peanut butter to the pot and reduce the heat to low. It's so satisfying to watch the peanut butter melt into the honey. Then I'm going to add my oats, cereal, and raisins and mix everything together off the heat. You want to make sure this is mixed really well so everything is nice and coated. I've lightly greased my pan here and I'm pressing the mixture into the pan. One tip is to use small piece of parchment paper or aluminum foil to really press down the mixture so it holds together. The hardest part of this recipe is waiting for the bars to cool off before you eat them. Once the bars are set, cut them in 16 pieces, then dig in. For more recipes and healthy tips, visit cowfreshhealthyliving.org.